Alright everybody, I need to come up with some sort of catchphrase at the beginning of these things. But I purchased off of eBay through Dave and Adam's card world, I think it's, yeah, DACW, a box that so you probably already know what is in here, because you saw the title of the video on the thumbnail, of 2016 Tops. I thought just I didn't know this was that old. Um, top Star um, Star Wars card trader trading cards. Um, basically, there's an app um, where you can like get coins every day and or buy coins with real money and open digital packs of cards. Um, this is what the base set looks like. And I played it for a while, and I was like, yeah, this is. It kind of got old to me, but I really like the designs of the cards and like the parallels and all that stuff. So this is going to be really, hopefully, fun to open. Hopefully, I can make a base set. It's 24, 24 cards, six cards per pack. Should I say twenty-four packs, six cards per pack? Well, there you go. There's a uh, rare tops typo, and this is a hobby box, and I paid like thirty-six dollars for it. So not too bad. It came from New York, and I'm on the West Coast, and it got here in two days, which is kind of some sort of a miracle. Ugh. I don't think there's any hits in here, besides like the potential, the possibility of numbered inserts. Um, but we'll see. So my 24 packs times six. So I might be able to make a full set. If not, I'll pick up what I'm missing off to check out my cards. Um, I don't care about the digital code, so I'll probably end up selling those on eBay or something. Recoup some of my money. All right, so we got Wedge. That's the base, is like a silver border. They feel a little cheap, like as far as like the card stock, they're kind of thin, but no big deal. Greedo, Biggs, I thought that was another Wedge. We got Darth Maul, pretty sweet. An insert of Poe, and a, I think it's considered teal insert, and it's got a, uh, oh, maybe that's the, uh, the one where you get the digital cards from, so, I, I would imagine, oh, I guess we could look at the odds, if anybody's interested real quick. Um, Park and Oxford Pack. So red is one in four, green is one in one in forty-one. So might get one of those. Um, orange is one in eighty-two. So that's definitely not happening. Battle damage one in four hundred and six. Slave one one in four thousand. Film quotes one in four. Classic cards one in five. Collecting moments one in five. Bounty one in five. Reflections one in eight. Top choice one in sixteen. Rare digital autographs are blue one in. 788, red one in 1978, gold one in 18,000, jeez. Uh, loot card one in 24, so I guess loot card is the uh, the one per box type deal. We've got Grievous, Cody, Lando, an insert, Captain Phasma, a bounty, Darth Maul, and then the TL, which those are the ones that have the codes on them. So, hopefully I can get a rare insert, that'd be kind of cool. Not insert, but parallel. R2, General Pabdana, Sidon Nathano, I think is how you say him. I know. Reflections, Django Fett, and then the blue or teal. Luke. Forlom, Tuscan Raider, Emperor's Royal Guard, Admiral Piet, Leia and Bounty Hunter Disguise, and Savage Opress. So it is one something insert every pack. I don't know if I'm going to try to do a master set of these with the inserts unless they're like super cheap on Check Out My Cards. Mace Windu, let's kill Django Fett, we killed. 
Saj, Cad Bane, ooh, red, General Veers, which is not numbered, but it's got the, uh, the thing on it. I don't know what those are for. If somebody knows, let me know. Digital trading cards, that's oh, another one, I guess. Free pack of exclusive digital trading cards, there you go. So that's kind of neat. What were the reds? One and four. Oh, so not that big of a deal. Lobot, Stormtrooper, a new Hopalaya, Snoke. Oh, that's really cool. Star Wars Celebration, one Galactic Moments card. And it's a trap. I actually remember those Galactic Moment cards from the app. Uh, Dr. Cloney, yeah, she's a chick who fixed up Chewie. Ray, pretty sweet card. Dengar, Jawa, Wicket, Jawa. Harrison Dula on the back. Zam Wessel, Harrison Dula on the front. Savage Opress. You are under arrest, my lord. Mace Windu, quote, card, reflections, Harris Nula. It's about time for another red. I guess we're gonna get a red in this one. Phasma, Balatique, Sidious. Oh, that's cool. Galactic Moments uh, tops trading cards, the original vintage ones. Wedge Bounty card, Emerald Piet. Chirpa, it's a trap, Emperor, Antilles, Jabba, and Dr. Colonia. Yeah, those have the, the, the barcode things on them too. I might uh, pause this video and Google it and find out what that even means. First order Stormtrooper, Snow Trooper, not Stormtrooper, Tasu Leech. General Medine, Mon Mothma, eBay notification, with the Wookiee win, and Bosk. You should probably see what's in it. What is something you guys would be interested in? It's like a, uh. Oh, that'd be fun. It's a, uh. SDCC Luke's, um. Land Speeder. It's at $141. We'll see if it ends up. It's already more than I want to pay for it. It was a uh, Lor Senteca, Padme, Kanan, Rex, Garandan, Balatik. Wicket, Jabba, Doug Vader, General Hux, Red Clone Trooper, Blue Jabba. This is a really funny SNL skit where they're making fun of adult Star Wars collectors, which it was, it was really funny. And uh, the little kid's like, oh yeah, this guy's name is Doug Vader. <laughs> yeah, it's pretty funny. Coracella. Tito, that's a guy I don't know his name. PZ Forcio. Han Solo. Insert. Classic art. Lobot. We get like one of those rare inserts. Green, one in 141. And if you combine that with the one in 182s, or 182, like statistically, we should have like a two thirds shot of getting one of those. Rune Hako, Seven Sister, the first time we've had to flip. Odd. Chewy, flipping back. Red Kanan. Star Wars Moments, May 25th, 1977. It's opening day at Manchester's Theater. General Hux, blue. Nine Numb. General Veers, Bib Fortuna. Riot Control Stormtrooper. Bounty Han Solo. Orlom, blue. Stack his slid. Anakin Skywalker, 
Ezra Bridger, Soka Tano, General Hux. Ooh, green. All right. It's a green Imperial Royal Guard. And blue Rune Hako. The green is numbered 98 and 99. Well, ain't that pretty cool? Yes, yeah, so that's going to be our hit for the box. Probably not the greatest hit in the world. Not going to lie. Grand Inquisitor, Max Relo, Salacious Beat Crumb, IG-88, Galactic Moments, filming Star Wars New Hope, Mace Windu. Hey, at least I got one though, right? I can't... This is just good old fashioned fun right here. Yoda, Han Solo, BB-8, Chopper, it's like a droid pack. This is my apprentice, Darth Maul, Max Rebo without his band. We'll be going Kenobi, First Order Stormtrooper, Dr. Ivanza, Sabine Wren. I want to learn the ways of the Force and become a Jedi like my father, and a Blue Royal Guard to go with my green one. Fifth Brother, Admiral Statura. Oh, I guess he's from Force Awakens, so I'm not familiar with him. Poe, Sai Snoodles, Bonnie Hunter Greedo, Blu ray. Ha! Get hit, Blu ray. Oh. Time for me to go to bed. Maz Kanata, Clone Trooper, Zeb. He's no good to me dead. Boba Fett, followed by Reflections Boba Fett, followed by Blue Cannon. Got two packs left. Give me one right out of these last two packs and I'll be happy. First sort of flame throat flame trooper. Major Emat. Fan lightsaber. Zuckus. Galactic Moments Heir to the Empire. And a blue Leia. It could kind of be fun to build the parallel sets of this. Maybe. We'll see. Probably not gonna happen though. Tarkin, Fett, 3PO. Red Amidala. Grizz Fricks. Odd. Cad Main. That is it. The best card was at number 299. Emperor's Royal Guard. Or Imperial Royal Guard. I always consider them Emperor's Royal Guard. But those are my cards. I'm going to see if I can put together a set. Trying to kind of do all the different top sets that are available. It's a kind of a fun little extra way I can waste a lot of time and money. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Be sure to leave a like. Comment what your favorite card design is down there. And I am out.